Call of Duty Black Ops 3 A month ago I received some good news that DLC was coming out. I also received some news that this one was going to cost us, even though I had season pass already. Luckily this didn't annoy me at all. All the maps included in this DLC were remastered and I was eagerly waiting them. On 16th of May I managed to download it. Fuck, it took a long time. It cost me 24 pounds and 99 cents. But for this money I received 15.4 gigabytes of happiness. As did everyone, I received 20 vials of liquid divinium. Two all new wormsicle gobble gums. Exclusive Zombies Pack of Punch Weapon Camo. I never use weapon camos. It's uh, it's good to have them, but uh, not worth the money if they're free. Well, let it be. And not to mention, Black Ops 3 Zombies Chronicles dynamic system theme for PS4, featuring artwork by re-owned artists. Awesome. I have always been a fan of zombie games or zombie mode in Call of Duties. Third one in the series was one of the best, but I still couldn't forget the Kino or you know Cinema Map and Moon and other good ones. So for me this DLC was actually an icing on a cake. Uh, quite expensive icing but still. Tasty one nonetheless. So what can I say about this DLC? All the maps look beautiful. Compared to the old one, there's more detail, there's more textures, it's just beautiful to play and look. For your money you actually get 8 maps. 3 of them from World at War. 4 maps from Black Ops, the first one. My favorite one. This has Kino Der Doten, Ascension, Shangri-La and Moon. And also one map from Black Ops 2, Origins. For this video I didn't actually play all of them, I just used the material from Kino and Moon. Not ruining the surprise, you can actually play them yourself. And as you can imagine, they're perfectly detailed and remastered to perfection. What I mostly love about this DLC, that it kind of combines all the good maps into a single gameplay. That way I don't need to find new discs from my shelf to play the previous maps. It also gives me a possibility to level up my character in single game and I don't have to divide my experience points between different black opses. Ops, ops, opses. Yeah, opses it is. Every map looks good, feels good and it's uh, basically the same gameplay but on a different kind of graphical level. It's still as difficult as it used to be. There were some rumors couple of weeks ago that you can take one more hit from zombie before going down. Sadly this can't be proven because I die as fast as in previous games. The good news is that as we speak there is double XP going on so everyone can level up really really fast. All your level progress will continue from where you left off couple of years ago. And it made me a happy camper to see my prestige level 4 still shining. Game also kept my weapon progress and I was uh, truly happy. But... My third game on this DLC I tried one of the old maps. One of my favorites, the giant. I managed to get some good companions and made one of the best games on this map I've ever played. When round 36 came up, the game froze and uh, basically it kicked me out without me receiving any experience points. This really angered me and I quit playing for several days. And I was thinking to myself, what the fuck were they doing when they were remastering the game? How the fuck couldn't you fix this stupid thing? I've lost around 20 games for your stupid ass servers, you motherfuckers. 
Can you understand me, motherfuckers? And it was especially painful when there's double XP going on. I almost shat my pants with anger. It's been four days since I last played, and I think that tonight I'm going to have a new try. I hope the fuck it works. Sadly, I don't have the material for you for this failure, because this was the only time I was not recording. So shit happens. Anyway, in conclusion, this DLC 5 is great, it's good, and I love it. I really, really love it. It's worth the money, it's worth the time. If the servers are working and you're not losing your game progress. So, I think this is it. This is my short review for this DLC 5. I hope you learned something and I hope you download it yourself. I'm Silly Lamas and I truly thank you for watching. Till next time.